Sorry, I tried saying bye. I was winning a Fortnite game with nine kills. Oh, I was like, did he win? I heard something, yeah, I won. Oh, yay! Joey. Okay. I want to say goodbye. Okay. Good luck with your wedding dress. Thanks, I love you. Love you. Please excuse this angle. I could not find my car tripod. So you guys are just propped up with a normal tripod. Let's hope this works, whatever. Anyways, I am on my way right now to pick up my wedding dresses. Yes, I have two. One that I'm going to walk down the aisle with and another one that I'm going to wear at the party. I know, very extra. <laughs> By the time that this video goes up, I will have already walked down the aisle. So there will be no secrets. I will show you guys the actual wedding dresses that I got. And before I do pick up the dresses, I wanted to give you guys a little explanation of how the whole process has been. Because I did mention it in a few other videos, I believe, that I bought my dress very, very, very impulsively. Sorry, I just wanted to make sure you weren't gonna fall. But yeah, I bought my first dress very impulsively. Like, it was the first time I tried on that dress. I actually, was going to buy another dress and then when I tried on this one dress that I did buy, I fell in love with it, bought it, got shopper's regret the moment I walked out of the store, but at that point it was already too late. Um, but yeah, the reason why I wasn't completely in love with my dress was that I always envisioned myself with long sleeves. And not only that, but Luthu as well has always told me that he loved dresses with long sleeves and so I kind of always had that in the back of my head and I also love dresses that are very you know modest so I was like hmm what can I do what can I do so I called the brand that I bought the dress from which was Monique Louyer which is a French brand and they referred me over to the seamstress in downtown and I was like okay let me give it a try. So I went there, tried on my dress and everything, and then told her kind of an idea of what I wanted. And I pretty much just left it up to her. I knew that whatever she would make would be beautiful. So I was like, hey, you know, you do it. Here are some reference photos, but you work your magic. And that she did. So here is a photo of how my dress looked initially when I first bought it. And in just a few moments, you will see how my dress looks like now. I'm so excited to show it to you guys. Ta-da! How beautiful is it? Oh my God, I am so in love with this dress, especially the sleeves. Look at how delicate and beautiful they are. I feel like such a princess in it. And this is Jocelyn. Jocelyn, do you mind Hi. being on camera? How are you guys? She's the one that created this masterpiece. It's all thanks to her. She's absolutely amazing. I'm going to it's link- It's gonna be one of my new sample, I mean, new design, and it will be named Lana. Oh, I love it, I love it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna link her information down below because she's amazing. If you guys need a seamstress, seriously, she's the best. She creates the most beautiful wedding dresses. And obviously, she alters as well, as you can see here. I mean, this dress doesn't even look like the same dress as it was before. But yeah, so we added the sleeves. I also wanted to just make it a little bit less low cut. Um, we added a little belt. I just, I'm just so in love with it. Oh, and also the back. How beautiful is this back? Before it was completely closed and then I told her to open it and make a little, what is this called? Like a, a big keyhole. A, a keyhole. keyhole, yes, a huge keyhole. <laughs> and I just think it looks so, so pretty. pretty. I need to still work on my tan line because I still have a, a subtle uh -huh. one. But I just, I'm so in love with this dress. Jocelyn. Good. Seriously, That's so really amazing. good. You are a magician. Thank you. I cannot be happier. I was happy working with that dress. Yeah. Oh, it looks so pretty. And then we're also going to be able to mm -hmm. like bustle it up. Yeah, this the pipe bustle. Yes, because as you can see, the train is very, very long. Um, but yeah, thank you so much. You. I really think that Luthu is going to love it. At least I hope. But yeah, isn't it so nice? It's so dreamy. I can't wait to wear it down the aisle. 
so my mom bought me these earrings for me to wear with my dress i don't know if it's really going to match so much with this dress i'm still trying to decide because i feel like this dress is so hold on let me try to adjust the camera <laughs> i didn't do anything um but yeah i feel like this dress is so just it's such a statement already that i i think i maybe should not wear anything on my ears and much jewelry at all um but yeah i'm still deciding since i already have it here let's try it on with this dress so i'm gonna take off my jewelry okay one earring two earrings okay one necklace down second necklace I wear too much jewelry. And the third necklace, which I actually bought thinking that maybe I would wear it down the aisle because it says Luthu on it. Yeah, you're definitely not gonna be able to see that, but trust me, it does. It's so cute. As for my hair, I kind of wanna do like a half up, half down look. Initially, I wanted to put flowers, but again, I think that this dress is just too much of a statement already so I feel like it's best to leave it as minimal as possible but let's see how it looks with these earrings if not I may have to just resort to wearing studs of some sort oh, I love the earrings I feel like you would think that with a dress like this typically a bride would wear very you know petite earrings but I feel like this adds an unexpected feel and it adds more of a youthful feel in a way just because this is so 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 elegant and so royal like that i feel like this adds a bit of a balance my hair will probably be like this on both sides i can't do it and hold the camera at the same time but yeah it'll look something like this let me see if i can pull it around okay there we go you can kind of get an idea of how it'll look. Mm. I do like it with the with the earrings. So pretty. I can't wait to be married. I can't believe that it's happening so soon. I'm so excited. I'm seriously, I'm already getting emotional thinking about it again. It's just such a cool feeling to know that you're gonna marry your best friend and that you're gonna have a, a ceremony to celebrate your love for one another <laughs> so cheesy but it's gonna be amazing I know it but yeah what did you guys think of the dresses did you guys like it is it what you expected me to wear or did you guys think that I was gonna go down a different route because initially I really thought that I was gonna go for a more boho kind of dress but then I put on a dress that was a bit more princessy and I was like, this feels right. You know, it's funny how we imagine ourselves with one thing and we usually end up going for something completely different. It's not always the case, but from the people that I have spoken to that have gotten married, they've said that the dress that they ended up choosing was completely different than what they thought that they would choose. So yeah, it's, it's crazy how it can sometimes surprise you, but for the best, you know, good kind of surprise. I just felt like there aren't that many moments in my life where I can be able to dress up like a princess, but for my wedding, hell yeah, I'm going to. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um, thank you guys so much for coming along. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Being able to be kind of a part of, of the special day. Um, I think I'm gonna try to film a few things while I'm in Spain. I also may be too nervous and I may not even film anything, but I'm gonna try. But if not, then I'm sure you'll be able to see pictures and stuff like that on social media. Um, and if I have any pictures by the time that this does go up, then I will also attach them right after I finish saying goodbye, which is happening right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. And once again, for being a part of my life and of this special day and these special moments that I'm experiencing. And I will see you guys very soon. Whee!